If you're struggling to write your book, if it feels like you're beating your head against a brick wall, if the blank screen on your laptop is just staring at you, obnoxiously judging you, this video will tell you the three types of help that is available so you can get moving and finally write your book. I'm Liz, the writer behind Green Goose Ghostwriting. I help entrepreneurs who want to write a book to demonstrate authority in their niche and get more speaking engagements. I write their book in their own voice so they can share their message, inspire others and finally level up their business. But ghostwriting isn't the only type of help available and it might not be right for you. So we're going to talk about the three main types of help you can get during the writing process so you don't have to struggle alone. It doesn't have to be so hard and you don't have to do it alone. Okay, type of help number one is an editor. They, uh, this is the best option if you already have a bunch of stuff written but you know it's not as good as you want it to be. So they can look at what you've already written, what you've already done and they'll tell you how to improve it. There are different types of editing available with lots of different names but basically it will either be big structural issues or the smaller kind of language tweaking stuff. What do you have to do to work with an editor? You have to write your book. Most editors will work with you after you've completed the full first draft. So write your book, then you get their feedback, which like I said, might include some really big, move this, move that, or it might be smaller little language improvements, depending on the type of edit you've asked for. And then you have to make the edits based on their feedback and you improve your own work. And that's great because you can learn as you go. Writing help number two is a writing coach. This is a great option if you want to do the writing yourself, but you just can't seem to get your butt in that chair. You've probably already started writing, though maybe not, but you know that you are never going to get it done unless someone is sitting there holding you accountable. So a coach will help you set writing goals and help you achieve them. What do you have to do to work with a writing coach? You will set up regular check-ins with your coach. Then you will write a targeted amount of words or chapters between each check-in session. If you don't meet your goals, because it's hard, uh, you'll work with your coach to figure out what the challenges are and break them down so you can start meeting your writing goals. Writing help number three is a ghostwriter. And this is the best type of writing partner for people who have all of the ideas, but they frankly don't want to sit down and type everything out and then try and make it make sense as a book. They know this isn't their strong suit. They know that their time is much better spent on the millions of other things they have to do in their business, but they do still want to get the book done. So you might have an, just an idea or maybe you've tried to write an outline, but probably much more than that. What do you have to do to work with a ghostwriter? You have to sit down for a set number of hours and just tell them everything you know and get it all off your chest. Then you work on your business and you do the millions of things you have to do while the ghostwriter does the actual writing. And then you have to read through the writing to make sure that it sounds like you, that it properly communicates your message and you'll likely do that one chapter at a time so there's not too much of waiting. And then you tell them anything you don't love so they can change it. So there you have it, three types of help available to get you writing your book, an editor, a writing coach, and a ghostwriter. If you want a recommendation for an editor, a writing coach, or a ghostwriter, who is good for you specifically, then stick a comment below this video. Tell me what type of book you're writing, because that's key. And then I will reply with some advice and recommendations. And if you found this video helpful, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to get more useful stuff about writing for your business. I'll see you next time.